What's going on, Bears fans? So, the Bears have been busy. Uh, yesterday, on Wednesday, they signed quarterback Tim Boyle and defensive lineman Andrew Brown. They placed Dane Crookshank on injured reserve. And their um, injury report is pretty, pretty stacked. I mean, they have a... Uh, it's, it's full with the amount of players that's on this injury report. And with the signing of the of the quarterback, I do believe that Justin Fields will probably not play this week because they signed another quarterback. I mean, I know they want to have the death just in case, but we know Trevor Simeon is banged up. He's on the injury report with his oblique, and he did not participate. Larry Borum with an ankle in the knee did not participate. Jaquan Brisker with the still in concussion protocol. Chase Claypool with his knee is a limited participant. Justin Fields, of course, with his shoulders, a limited participant. Kyler Gordon is still in concussion protocol. Dante Pettis was out with the illness, didn't participate. Riley Reef with a back injury, didn't participate. Kendall Vildor with an ankle injury was a limited participant. And Sterling Weatherford was in concussion post concussion protocol, but he was a full participant. So, um, so the the Bears have definitely had to make some moves because the team is definitely looking different. I mean, it's looking completely different than it did last week and the week before coming up this um week and this being Packers week. I know a lot of people say, well, Justin should play, but if he's injured, he shouldn't play. He should not play because I want to beat the Packers as much as anybody. I, I can't stand the cheesy heads. I want to beat them as much as anybody, but I want to beat them over a long period of time. I want to establish dominance over them. And we can't do that if number one goes down for a long period of time or, God forbid, you know, he does something to, to, to hamper his career. We don't want him to have the same type of situation that happened to RG3. So um, I don't think if, if he's not ready, I don't think he should play. And he's also... We voted into one of the top 25, under 25 in the league and everything. And um, he's, he's a dynamic player, and we're lucky to have him. And we're going to see what's going to happen. So we don't know if Nathan Peterman's going to start, Trevor Simeon, or Boyle. So it's going to be interesting. Our fields can start, too. So one of four quarterbacks can start for the Bears. Bear down forever. Thank y'all. I really appreciate y'all. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. All right. I'm out.